Freak of Nature was, I think, the first song that we wrote. It was one of the first, yeah. Yeah, so it was one of the first songs that we wrote in the process of writing the album. Georgia sat down and played the song, and it was like sunset, and the studio is like really beautiful at like dusk. Sunbeams in the windows, and this is just a big, big open room, and she's just on this huge piano, and she goes, oh, I think I've made up something cool. She played it to me, and I was like, yep. Mm-hmm. It's all right. <laughs> it's pretty cool. It just sat there for like, I want to say like a good year, just yeah. in demo stage. And then I've, I've always got like these demos sitting on my phone and um, we're at Oceaga Festival and I was in Tovlo's green room showing her what we've kind of been working on for the new album and I played her the song Freak of Nature and she was like, that's my favourite. <laughs> and I said, do you want to sing on it? She's like, are you serious? <laughs> yes! <laughs> and yeah, we kind of sent it to her and I said, I want you to write your own verse and I want you to put your own spin on what you think, what you take from the song. The whole theme of Freak of Nature is the idea that people will often look at somebody with some sort of way of thinking that's not their way or someone with a mental illness or somebody that feels like they're different and they'll look at them and they'll say, oh, it's okay, I'm gonna fix you. When sometimes it's not even what needs to happen, like it, you don't need to be fixed. You know, you can see that because you're sad all the time, it's just because you're a freaking em empathetic person, like you're actually a really kind person that just feels for other people. And it's like, it just really frustrated me for so long because I, I thought that that was my situation and then I just completely decided that it was going to be beautiful instead. Decided <laughs> <laughs> to cry. Yeah, it's my favourite. <laughs>